Lego Masters might be over, but there is a way to keep your Lego dream alive. WA's very own Brickman is building an army of volunteers, creating a holiday icon masterpiece that'll take a staggering 160 hours to complete. The Bustleton Jetty is being rebuilt. With Lego, that is. WA's very own Brickman is taking on one of his biggest challenges yet. A six metre replica of the longest jetty in the Southern Hemisphere. We wanted to do something iconic from Western Australia and uh, the bustle on jetty is, is pretty iconic. And it's been in the works for a while, fundraising for four years. Along the way, building an army of Lego legends to help keep this dream alive. It's cool to build with people who know a lot about Lego and able to put in their own unique view on it. I like to be part of something big. A personal collection wouldn't necessarily have this many parts, so it's a good way for the members to build something large and to build it together, so it's a community build. 30,000 Lego pieces is what it takes to build a structure like this, and you can see just how intricate it is. But it does require a lot of patience, estimated to take 160 hours to complete. But it's more than just a bit of fun. For many, it's about challenging different parts of the brain. I think the really big difference there is that he's always built from his imagination, but here he's forced to build to specs, <laughs> which is really different. I think when you're child, it's very important to feel like you're part of something yeah. you belong. It's like kind of finding your family, your team, other like-minded people. The team is now on the hunt for an event to put their Lego jetty on display. Ready just in time for WA Day. Lucy McLeod, Nine News.